Ever heard of the blue economy? India just unlocked a hidden treasure. Not gold, but fish. Deep sea fish. Let's dive in. India is already the second largest fish producing country in the world. 8% of global catch. But did you know that most of this comes from shallow coastal waters? Our deep sea zone, over 2 million square kilometers EEZ, remains largely untapped. Niti Aayog ne abhi ek nai report launch ki hai. India's blue economy, strategy for harnessing deep sea and offshore fisheries. Aim to turn India's vast ocean space into a sustainable engine of growth. The report suggests six major reforms. One, modernizing fishing fleets. Two, policy and regulatory overhaul. Three, capacity building for fishers. Four, sustainable fishing using science and technology. Five, financing and cooperative based models. Six, and community participation. Because blue economy starts at the coast. India plans it in three phases, 2025 to 28, foundation and early growth, 2029 to 32, scaling up to global competitiveness, 2033 onwards, becoming a global leader in sustainable deep sea fisheries. This means more jobs for coastal youth, higher exports, 60,000 crore plus, and reduced pressure on overfished coastal zones. It's geography, economics, ecology, all in one blue revolution 2.0. So, next time you see the sea on your map, remember, it's not just water, it's India's next growth frontier. If you want me to explain what exclusive economic zone really means, drop E in the comments.